Welcome back, everybody. Sinister here in the map Underground. So Domination is the game type, and we're unlocking how to play as a team. And to win this in this game type, you have to control the respawns. And to do that, you have to set up in a certain area of the map and be committed as a team to stay within that area so that you respawn together instead of all through the map and constantly are sh being shot in the back. Now, Underground is a city that, it's a map that's set in a London subway station. You'll see as a team, we commit to capping B flag. We know that that initial spawn flag is so close that we don't need to send multiple teammates over there to cap it. So, as we roll out onto the A and B flag, once we've been successful in capping the B flag, we stay within this area. The benefit here is if you can hold B... And then set up in the cafe in the lower right-hand portion of your screen. You can shoot down the sidewalk and prevent any recapping from the other team. Now, you have to be aware of a couple po points. You have to be aware from the subway underneath where an enemy will come up. You'll see here is an enemy is coming up through the subway area behind the bus area. And it is Ish is holding down that A flag... I am covering him from the flower pots from any movement from the middle part of the of the central building, the train station area. Are the rest of our team is locking down B. If you want to win on this map, set up like this. You will win 95% of your games. Now there are always exceptions. If the team is way better connected, if they have way better organization, if they just dominate you in one particular area of the map, you may not always be successful, but if you sit up here like this, this pie or half semicircle, you will respawn on your teammates. So even if you lose a gunfight, you're right back in protecting and covering your team. So if an enemy kills you, you'll respawn right back on him and kill him right away. This is the frustration that many of us have been experiencing. We're wondering, why do I kill somebody and then they respawn right on me? Well, if the other team is set up in a disciplined way, that will happen. And until the enemy can split your forces as a team and push more of their people onto a certain part of the map, as the mechanic, the respawn mechanic stands right now, you will, will continue to respawn on your teammates. And as you see, even though we lose the gunfights, we continue to respawn on our team and they respawn on the opposite side of the map. And you'll see our perfect lineup here and setup. Pushing, the, pushing their respawn all the way on the top side of the train station. Frustrating for the other team. Is it satisfying for us? Yes, once we reach a point where we feel that the other team cannot win, we then put on a rush class and rush through, and everybody has their way. So we are committed to winning first, kill second. If that's your goal, if it's your goal to win... Then set yourself up as a team. Like any good team, you have to have good setup in any sport to win successfully. Does that mean you can't have fun? Well, Ish does really well and gains kill streaks as the other team continues to rush like like um, ships onto the ocean shore just being just demolished onto the rocks. Ish just continues to destroy them as they come in, gaining kill streaks, and once we put on our rush classes, we rush through the map and we get to do a little running in the map. But until we figure out how to push as an organized unit through the map, this serves as a way, as a plan to win in domination. Okay, hopefully you've learned something sinister here. Until next time, I'll catch you on Xbox Live.